but over the night and this morning I installed, and we'll see if it affects the game, I installed a couple of mods. I was going to try to go modless run, but I really wanted to respec some choices that I had made with Meryl's abilities, and um, we found those respec potions for sale down at the black marketplace for like a gold and a half, so I didn't think it was that big of a deal to install a mod that let me just push a button and respec for free. Um, and I just hit the button like an idiot, so let's uh, load up our quick save here. Um, <clears throat> I don't plan to be pushing the respec button a whole lot. I mean, if the reason there's a cost involved, I'm, I'm guessing in their design, was to make it so you didn't just respect every... between each battle. Um, all I wanted to do is remove a couple of abilities where I had, when we first started playing, I just clicked on because they looked like they might be fun. And, uh... Turns out, they probably would have been fun, but... Now let's look and see what abilities we have here that are... So we got... This is a... I'm looking at the ones that are sustain modes. The other thing I installed was a, uh, a mod that expanded the radius of a couple of aura abilities um, for Anders. <laughs> um, because Anders has a couple of abilities, he's got a heal ability that, um, actually let's just go back in here, read it. I don't think the mod author, uh, oh my gosh, let's turn that down. I don't think the mod author, uh, was able to go in and change the text, but we'll see. Um, To be honest, I'm not even sure if any of these other mods are working. So, um, but on Anders, he's got a couple of abilities. Um, abilities. Is it this one? Um, He's got this panacea here, which um, uh, increases. It's like the regeneration rate for everybody within a, a, a unit away. Let's see here. What's the name? Of, uh, go find this mod. Uh, where is that mod? Uh, easy buff. Oh yeah, that's the other one we got. Was we also got a mod that I'm trying to find the name of this or a mod like. Aura, here we go. Aura and Panacea range fix. Apparently, when the game first shipped, Panacea's range was uh, six meters. And uh, BioWare, in a later patch, bumped that up to 10 meters. And this mod uh, bumps up to 20. I had no idea how short the areas were. In some of the fight areas, he'll literally get stuck pathing. I mean, he, if he would just move four steps away from the wall, uh, he'd be able to reach the people on the other side. But because he's stuck in the wall, and without me going and man manually hand managing each of the characters, uh, I was... And I was under, I didn't even realize that they had a range. I read that as health regeneration rate for all party members. And I kept figuring, trying to figure out why it wasn't working when I was activating it. 
and it was working it was just really short so I installed a, the mod there that um, uh, increases the range um, and then I increased I got one that increases the cost of the junk items uh, as we were joking around yesterday um, the junk items in this game like you'll have 40 pieces of loot and then you'll go back to the vendor and you get like one gold. There's a couple of items in the vendor stores that are 90 gold and 80 gold and I'm sitting here at 116 so if I buy one of those items um, and to be honest the combat hasn't been super super compelling um, up to this point so figured I've played enough to give this a try and see. If it breaks things really bad, then we'll uh, pull, make those changes and rip that stuff out. Uh, for now, we need to uh, we need to go take care of a quest. And we're on the quest. We're going to take her with us and her with us. Both of these uh, uh, both of these characters wanted us wanted our attention. We needed help right now. Um, I hate bringing Anders with me. I, I really don't like him as a uh, as an NPC. His, his, his character just kind of annoys me. Um, I'm not too compelled by his story. Um, but he's the only healer. They took Bethany away from me. Um... And so I'm stuck. I thought about actually using that respec ability to, to respec Meryl as a healer, but that doesn't fit what she is in her character. Um, I think it kind of, I don't know, undermines who she is. So, um, but we're gonna bring Anders with us on this, on this mission because he's our healer. And I'm gonna bring, um, and I'm going to check these characters' uh, abilities because we did need to level up at the end of last night. Uh, okay, so let's see. We have level ups uh, for Anders. Uh, now, which one is it? Okay, so when we were looking at his abilities, um, for example, uh, we definitely want to go... Yeah, this is the passive. Yes, then we want that. Okay, so let's do this. And then we're gonna give him a little bit more health, more mad. We'll get to my character later. <laughs> I just didn't really want to play with my character. Um. Give her some strength and eat a bit more stamina. Or just double down in health. Yeah, let's give her stamina. Synergy. Where's Battle Synergy? Do that. Do a knockback. Okay. Cool. We are ready to go.
Hmm. Do we have vengeance on his bar? Oh wait, I'm wrong. Yeah, there's vengeance. Vengeance down here. Vengeance on his bar. Oh yeah, there's a reason why it's not on this bar. Okay. <laughs> this is interesting. This one doesn't say that vengeance has to be activated. It's just a passive ability. Yeah, see that says when vengeance is activated. I wonder if that's supposed to have been when vengeance is activated. It's probably why I'm not actually seeing it working. <laughs> probably get rid of those two points altogether. And take those two points and put them in here and here. That's not worth it. Okay, let's just move. Let's just move on. Actually, we can just now that we've loaded them up, we can just come back in here. To let us just teleport directly to where we need to go. Okay, her, her, and Anders. Try this. Um, to catch a thief. Dirk wall at night? Is that where we need to be? Let's do it. Let's do it. Okay. Dirk wall at night. Dirk wall at night. I probably haven't cleared all the Kirkwall streets. Hold! You will surrender the relic. I don't have your stupid relic. belongs to the Canari, and there's a small chance they want it back. Mm, I need to know the truth. Tell me what you know. You can trust me. I've always known what the relic is. I just didn't want to worry you. The relic is a Canari text handwritten by that philosopher of theirs. Uh, Keslin, Kuzland, whatever his name is. I stole it from them. They followed me here to reclaim it, and it's why they're still in Kirkwall. And they can't leave without it. All of this could have been avoided. How did you steal the relic from the Canari? The Arashok never had it. The Orlesians did. They had plans to return it to the Canari. I simply had to waylay the Orlesian convoy before it met up with the Arashok and his men. Getting the relic was easy. Getting away from the Canari was the hard part. I 
I thought you and the Kunari were caught in a storm. The storm was only half of it. I also had the Kunari Dreadnought stuck to my behind like a bad rash, spitting fire and thunder at me. You could have done something about the Kunari, but you didn't. Done what? The blighted thing didn't show up for three years. Look, the book's right in this building, and I'm not letting it slip away again. There's more at stake, but... Well, the Arashok waited this long. Oh, I don't know. It's the only thing that'll get Castillon off my back. Please, tell me you'll give the relic to me. The artifact belongs to the Kunari, and you'll let them leave with it. There's a cost to both sides. Don't you understand? The relic is the only thing that will keep Castillon from feeding me to the sharks. I can't believe you're... Oh! <sighs> Fine. You're right. I'll return the relic. It'll go straight to the Kunari once we get it. Come on, we've no time to waste. Where is the relic? I... Uh... I have it! The Tome of Coastland will not fall into Defender hands! Blood and spite! A toss, Kanari! He's getting away! Isabella! Okay, hold on a second. So... Okay, so first, what? Darn it, it's not gonna let me. <clears throat> okay, well, I guess I have to do. I have to do this? didn't save any of my okay well thanks game for I wanted to go look at my my settings ugh ugh okay this is why you should never rely on auto saves Relying on auto saves just got me screwed. Okay. Is this again? Leveling uh, up is.
I want to give him to 15 constant. Oh, he's out of mana. And then what did we decide last time? This one. And where are we already? Okay. Okay, so this time we will save here. And then fine, we're just gonna I'm pretty frustrated. One, I'm frustrated that the story is so dumb that the, she'd had, she, Isabella knew about the, the reason why the Canari were in town for three years and didn't ever say anything. Like, we could have been more actively looking is what I think. Okay. <clears throat> That's okay. Let's go. And honestly, she's... Looks like that bar is far enough over that hopefully she'll return. But we have to give this back to the air shock. Let's finish this! 
much, so much loot. Okay. Um... to choose it. <clears throat> We're going to save there. Hold! You will surrender the relic. I don't have your stupid relic. So I might want to have Bethany with me instead of Anders, or not Bethany, uh, Meryl instead of Anders. <clears throat> because this guide says I can get friendship points, I don't get any with uh, This is what I get. The fact that the friendship points only occur apparently for people in your group. And we're about to make a decision that's going to give us a bunch of. Uh, we go up and around. Go up and around so we don't trigger the cutscene. Um, I was bringing Anders with me because he's a healer. But instead, we're going to bring Meryl with us so that way when we make the choice to help. Yeah, let's gather our party. We're going to go girl squad, teen girl squad. Bye bye, Anders. Aveline's already a friend of ours, but we need a tank, I think. <clears throat> okay. So, yeah, according to this guide, um, if we choose to side with Isabella, we can boost our friendship dramatically. And since over here, somewhere it shows our friendship, our friendship here. So she's already locked 
as a friend. So we don't even really need her with us. We're still trying to get her up as a friend. And I'd like to get her locked as a friend. So I think what we'll do is... And Fenris... Fenris just frustrated me. The way they had him... Like my character like was falling in love with him. And then he's hates mages though. And totally ran off. And got scared. So... I'm gonna, I'm less worried about him, although, well, let's get Varric in our, in our group. This is gonna be a dangerous fight, <laughs> because we're gonna not have a tank. Um, we'll have Varric in our group. Let's see how his, uh... Okay, so he's already locked as a friend, too, so we don't need him. And what is this? This guide says, Beric. Yeah, so we can just, that's good. Doesn't say anything about Fenris getting it. So we ditch Put her in and her. We'll go back out here. Okay, so this will maximize. This is a big chunk of friendship. Heck is it? What is going on with the streets of Kirkwall tonight? Like, dog lords are just all out in the game. Out of the Should have brought Varric. <laughs> Gotten an extra set of the. Okay, so. And we've got new Meryl. Our freshly respect Meryl, which also, let's fix that before I. Before I accidentally hit that button again. Let's go to abilities. Let's zoom in here and let's take this off our bar. There we go. <clears throat> Okay, here we go. We'll go see how these guys are facing. Hold! You will surrender the relic. I... I don't have your stupid don't relic. don't have your stupid relic. Not has no honor. This begins here. Anon is some cue! belongs to the Canari, and there's a small chance they would tell me what you I the relic I st and they can't leave without it all of this could have been avoided how did you the I getting the relic was easy getting away from the Canari was the hard part I thought you and the the I also had the Canari Dreadnought stuck to my behind like a bad rash, spitting fire and thunder at me. How did you s Getting the relic was easy. Getting away from the Canari was the hard part. Why would anyone besides the Canari want this relic? The Tevinta Imperium have been at war with the Canari for centuries. If the Tevintas get the relic, it will strike a blow to Canari morale. 
That's probably what the mages want. Maybe giving it back would solve Aveline's problem. It couldn't hurt. Says you. I know it will save my skin. Ah, oh, Why can't this be as easy as you? Sounds like the Canari take their reading very seriously. Is there anything the Canari don't take seriously? I'm sure there's something. Maybe knock-knock jokes? Look, the book's right in this building, and I'm not letting it slip away again. There's more at stake, but... Well, the Arashok waited this long. Oh, I don't know. It's the only thing that'll get Castillon off my back. Why don't we just Please, kill Castillon? Tell me you'll give the relic to me. It's yours. Your life depends on it. Really? I... I wasn't expecting that. It's nice to have someone on my side for once. Don't make us regret it. Come on, we've no time to waste. Where is the relic? I... uh... I have it! The Tome of Coastland will not fall into Deventer hands! Blood and spite! A toss, Kanari! He's getting away! Isabella! New Meryl is good Meryl. <clears throat> yeah, respecting Meryl was was smart. Okay, we need to clear this building out. I don't know what we just picked up. I think that I always Watch your step! Watch your step. Is there a trap? I don't like the looks of this. Yeah, I don't think this guy's even really got the book. Oh my gosh, I'm stuck on the stairs. How many times do I get stuck on the stairs? 
we're gonna get out there and Isabella's gonna have this guy stuck dead. <clears throat> no book. She's gonna be all She's gonna turn up turn him into a book. Oh wait, how did Sten get out here? Sten was inside. No. No. Wait, that's the guy she was chasing. Okay. So did she find the book or not? I have the relic and I'm gone. I'm sorry it has to be this way. You've been loyal, ally. This is for the best for both of us. You promised me the relic and I know you'll fight Castile and I know you'll fight Castilian for me. But I don't want this. I've dragged you too far into this mess already. You don't have to forgive me. But I do hope you understand. Well, okay, fine game. She's gone. Just she took it. That bitch born <laughs> whore. whore. Well, now we get to deal with the Arashok and the fugitives ourselves. That's good. That's enough. Let's go to the compound. Jeez. Wow. What what a case of railroading there. <clears throat> the sounds coming from inside are always so cheerful. But I never know what to do in there. Thanks, Isabella. Well done. I'm so glad you, uh... You, you basically, uh, started a war. I mean, seriously. The woman's an idiot. Hey, let's steal from these Orlesians and steal a relic and then that's super valuable to the Quinari and then uh, knowing that they're here oh, oh she lost it by the way and then she spent two years trying to three years trying to find it this is just bad news for my Isabella she's just a bad person let's save this is gonna end poorly all right, Kirkwalk, you've been wanting a war. We're about to get one, I think. I'd wrap up any other business before we go. <laughs> it's already a mess and could get worse. Okay, so yeah, not yet. I still have things I need to do. Don't forget, as soon as you're finished wrapping up your business, we'll need to go to the Canari compound together. Okay, so we'll need to do this. Do we have anything else outstanding? We have this. Okay, so wait, how are you even gonna get to her? I'm not even sure this is She's not going to be here. So... I guess I should have done that quest before we... Should I have done that quest before we... To speak to Isabella in Low Town's Hanging Tavern, but she's already left. If that's the case, we're just going to live without it, without doing it, because I think she's already left at this point, too. Yeah, I'm not going to go back.
I, we're just gonna live without that quest because it didn't didn't give me any notification that we even had a new quest. It is kind of frustrating. <clears throat> In this side quest, which, where we're like searching Kirkwall for assassins, hunting kitchen, I don't one, I don't even really know Sketch, and two, I don't really care about these assassins trying to find them. And this really bugs me because they didn't give me an opportunity to actually know that that quest was in my journal. It wasn't there when we started the night, um, but no big deal. We'll let's just go take care of. Uh, See, do we have inventory problems? Yes, we do have inventory issues. Let's go back to. Let's go back to Hawk Estate really fast. We're just gonna go dump everything in our box. Good to see you again, sir. Wonder if that's better than like that's a ten percent critical chance and a twenty five percent chance to reduce attack speed and a twenty five percent chance to reduce movement speed. One hundred and two physical damage. Ninety five attack ten physical. That up. Let's see what my family's up to. Okay, there we'll just dump everything in there. Let's try to see if we can get through this end game or uh, this end act stuff before we Okay, let's go. We are off. We're gonna go do this. Don't worry about it. Wrap up any other business before we go. It's already a mess. Yeah, I'm ready. And could get worse. Let's go. I request an audience with the Arish shop. He will allow it, but not in this number. I will only bring my friend here and a small compliment of my guard. Is that few enough? It is. Enter. Greetings, Arashok. We come regarding the elven fugitives that took refuge here. 
irrelevant. I would speak to Hawk about the relics stolen from my grasp. I'll get it back for you. It is much too late for that. An issue for another time. We're here for the fugitives. The elves are now Fidithari. They have chosen to submit to the Kuhn. They will be protected. Surely you know these elves are only here to escape justice. Kirkwall justice. You have not hidden the abuses of your zealots or the corruption of this city. You will understand why I must do this. Let us look at your dangerous criminals. Speak, Vidathari. Who did you murder and why? A city guard forced himself on our sister. We reported him, or tried to, but they did nothing about it, no matter what we said. So my brothers and I paid him a visit. That doesn't excuse murder. Are these elves telling the truth? There have been rumors. I will investigate. But they still took the law into their own hands. Sometimes that is necessary. Like you avenged the Viscount's son. It was not right then, and it's not right now. Hmm... We're just here for the elves. Their actions are mere symptoms. Your society is the disease. They have chosen. The Vidithari will submit to the Kuhn and find a path your way has denied them. You can't just decide that. You must hand them over. Tell me, Hawk. What would you do in my place? Hmm, what would we do? Uh... <sighs> I know he wouldn't let them go. If I were in his place. guy says, I mean, I kind of don't think I'd give up them. I would. <clears throat> As a guest in this city, 
I would keep the peace. I see. I cannot leave without the relic, and I cannot stay and remain blind to this dysfunction. There is only one solution. Arishok, there is no need for... Vinek Kathas. Can you hear it? The Canari must be spreading out. They're attacking the city. Why? What could they possibly hope to accomplish? It doesn't matter. We need to act. I agree. We can't do anything on our own, however. Isabella, this is all your fault. Oh, there you are. I was so worried about you. Are we under attack? The Canari are assaulting the city, and fast. The Arashok planned this for who knows how long. We should head to the keep to rally my guardsmen. Whatever happens, be careful. I'm a little frustrated because I guess that's the way of this stories. I'm gonna get Where are we going? We're in Low Town. We need to make it to the keep. Oh, they're gonna make us fight all the way through. I see. I see what's happening. Whoa, that's Bethany. Holy cow, where'd Bethany come from? What the WT... Hey, sister, can we talk? I haven't seen you in three years. Like a week, let's play. Be you. Bethany! Hello, sister. How fitting we should meet here. Are you injured? Are there more of you? 
This is everyone. Thank you. You have our sincere thanks. This attack was <clears throat> most unexpected. Most unexpected. Stroud, we need to move. We've already delayed too long. Very true. I cannot believe the Kunari would dare such an attack. This will lead to war with the Free Marches for certain. I fear pressing matters take us elsewhere, but we can spread word to the other free cities. Perhaps they will bring aid. Wait. I need to tell you about Mother. I know. When we got the news, the Wardens helped me hold awake. I'm... glad you were with her. In her final moments. This is not the time. Take this. It is all we can spare, but perhaps it will be of use. What did he give me? Goodbye, sister. Take care of yourself. Make her watch over you, my friend. Uh, wait, wait, but my sister. They... Ha! What did we get? We got a warden's promise. What's that? Ooh, critical damage. Physical damage. It's pretty much like the Ring of the Archmage. I already have upgraded. Exactly the same. Well. My term as captain has not been popular here. But you get used to it. You're probably going to be without a job after this. Okay, well, let's keep going. We got to see our sister. That was cool. We got to collect all the moth eaten scarves. We don't. We just go into the hanged man and get a drink. <clears throat> Barrack will take care of that. I am so glad we dumped everything out of our inventory. gonna end with me fighting Meryl's clan. They're gonna end up siding. That should do it. I think the keeper's not gonna approve of me running off with murdering a bunch of elves. failed to take you captive. Unfortunate. Okay, 
get some poison I can put on. Enemy magic resistance at minus 15%. I know you. The name Hawk has turned up in my reports many times. Too many. It's good that we found you, Knight Commander. The Canari are... It's obvious what they're doing. The Canari are taking people to the Keep, and may already be in control. We will need to deal with them. Why would they be gathering hostages? To get everyone important in one place, where they can be controlled, or killed. Charming. Why would they be gathering hostages? To get everyone... Charming. I'll do whatever it takes to defend my home. Good. Your skills will be sorely needed. Head to the keep and I will see if I can find more of my men. These creatures will pay for this outrage. She just murdered that dude. Sort of okay with it. They were trying to kill me. It's the first time we see the Night Commander. All set. She's been talked about a lot. <clears throat> for Saw some sparkles over here. An amulet. 
some point I'm just going to sell everything in my, my, my storage chest. Your heroism? going on with me why can't I pull, why can't I do these fights the first time I did it I had no problem Kunari are taking people to the keep and may already what to get charming. Good. Head. Right now, save. This is what I should have done last time. Why I didn't save. That should do. It's gonna get so focused on other things and I forget to save button. Seems better.
Okay, let's see. Now we'll save. You don't seem as badly injured as the others. The others? Surely they cannot all be. Gone. I told them to run. First enchanter Orsino. You survive. Your relief overwhelms me, Knight Commander. There is no time for talk. We must strike back before it's too late. And who will lead us into this battle? You? I will fight to defend this city as I have always done. To control it, you mean? I won't have our lives tossed to the flames to feed your vanity. We need to work together, not kill each other while we figure out who leads. Then, perhaps you should be leading us. What? She isn't even of this city. Neither am I. Yet I don't hear you complaining about us both fighting to defend our home. Very well then. But whatever you plan, be quick about it. Tell us then, what is our course of action? Interesting. What is our course of action? Does that actually change anything? We need to find out why they're gathering hostages. An excellent choice. Let's move quickly. I don't know why that was an aggressive choice, but...
There seem to be a great many Konari at the Keep's entrance. Then they've already taken it over. Clearly, they've been planning this for some time. I don't see any of my guardsmen. This is the only way in. We must assault them now before their numbers grow. Are you mad? They have hostages. We need a distraction. Decide quickly. We have no time. We can't risk a distraction. Orsino, make sure there are no surprises. But there's no checkpoint. Oh, there might be. Hold on. Oh, no, the checkpoint's here. <clears throat> okay, everybody hold. method. But at least And quickly. The reason why I chose attack was There's more coming. I assumed that Go. We'll <clears> deal with them. the air shock would respect us just being more militant. Yeah, because he's been. Seemed like he'd be ready for me to do a distraction. <clears throat> and Act Three of this game is going to be basically me being a body. Like I'm just going to be spending the entire third act of the game burying. And apparently, I don't give any good cuts. You got to take care of this guy. Mage of three. Do it. We need to find the mage. Where did the mage go? There he is. Okay, so now I'm running around. I'm basically just going to spend my entire time looting during the fight because cutscenes keep taking my loot away. <laughs> Oh, 
<clears throat> Come on, Andrews. Don't die on me. Good job, Andrews. <clears throat> <laughs> oh gosh, I'm dying. Okay, so respecking Meryl uh, has been a huge boon. That's worked out so much better. That and the mod that lets Anders' ability work the way I thought it worked this whole time. The heal everyone in your party <coughs> ability that apparently did not Heal everyone in your party. Good save. At least this time they gave me a chance to pick up loot. I don't think we're going to find anything worth picking up though. Let's see, your seal of Crookwall. Stamina. It's a dot. Both fire damage, but she doesn't do fire damage, but extra stamina. We'll take that. And her belt is regen. Hmm. I don't know if swapping. I don't know if swapping out attack for attack and physical damage, I mean, just straight up bonus damage is, seems better than. Okay, save. Here we go, go through the door. Cutscene time! Cutscene time! Here is your Fika! Oh my gosh! No! That's you disgusting. Dare? You are starting a war! Look at you! Like fat doth Rossi, you feed and feed and complain only when your meal is interrupted. You do not look up. You do not see that the grass is bare. All you leave in your wake is misery. You are blind. I will make you see. But we have guests. Shenadon, Hawk. I expected you. But for all your might, you are no different from these bars. You do not see. This madness must end. Perhaps. Pr 
prove yourself, Basra, or kneel with your brethren. City commands <clears throat> such respect. So tell me, Hawk. You know I cannot withdraw. How would you resolve this conflict? Isabella stole the Tome of Coslin. We find her, and you can leave Kirkwall. And is this not one of your companions? One I suspect you aided? The plan was to get the Tome and give it to you. Admirable, but I still do not have it. You will answer for the crimes of those who serve you. Their offense is yours. The demand of the Kune is clear, as it always is. Atash Varim Kata, in the end lies glory. Well, I could just kill you. First, we need to find... This is going to be tough. This is going to be tough. checkpoint okay so the air shock is a little insane as far as the strength Sinead, but for all your might you are no we can prove Is this not one of your companion? The pl uh, the uh, Okay, so 
let's do this. Instantly killed me. <clears throat> I may have to figure out something to do for difficulty here. Like maybe I can just lower the difficulty. To casual. But for all your might, you are no- Is not one of your compat You, the d Atash. dead. There's no... If it remembered. <clears throat> yeah, there's no... But for all your might, you are no... No change in... Um... It's like I'm at full health and then something kills me. I don't even know what it is. So tell me, Hawk, you know, and is this not one of your companion? A figure out a way to resurrect people because if we're just gonna have people dying instantly every time but for all your might you are no different from Wait. It's not one of a top.
focus or fire? I'm okay with lowering the difficulty. You seem confused, Seeker. It just seems so unbelievable. I would have assumed the stories were exaggerated. If I didn't know better, I'd say you developed a case of hero worship. Why? Because I have respect for a woman who built herself from nothing? Mm-hmm. If you're telling the truth. If you are, then... What happened at the gallows may be far different than we assumed. I need to hear it. Let's say I tell you. Then what? Is the Chantry out for revenge? Is that what this is all about? No, it's not that. Then what about me? If what I tell you isn't what you want to hear, will you still let me go? I will let you go. Well, now we're talking. None of this is what I thought it would be. Tell me what really happened. <laughs> Tell me what Champion happened. of Kirkwall. That was the reward. <laughs> A fine title. Every noble at the keep owed the champion their lives. She wasn't just a hero. She was now the most important person in the city. Except for Knight Commander Meredith, of course. With the Viscount dead, she stepped in to keep order. Things quickly got out of hand. The more she squeezed the mages, the more they resisted. The more they resisted, the tighter she squeezed. After three years of that, it all came crashing down. I know you fear us. Knight Commander Meredith uses that fear to take control of your city. She opposes every effort to replace Viscount Dumas. And you have seen the chaos of her reign. Will you allow it? Return to your homes. This farce is over. Wait! Perhaps there are some who might disagree with you, Knight Commander. Do not hide behind the champion. She has no role in this. Hmm. It would be better if you both calm down, before this gets violent. I should remain calm, while a mage provokes an uprising. I think not. I think the Champion's views would be appreciated, or do you fear what she has to say? I fear nothing. 
My only interest here is in keeping order and protecting the innocent. What are you trying to do here? Cause a rebellion? The people of this city need to know what is really happening. And then what? They tear down the gallows with pitchforks and torches? That would be better? It cannot be worse. Your refusal to listen to reason leaves me no choice. What I refuse to listen to are excuses. Perhaps you are ill-fit to your position if you cannot understand this. You're hardly receptive to whatever gets in your way. And I become less receptive each moment this nonsense continues. This won't be resolved here. We need to sit down and work it out. You are naive, champion. You will find that not everyone bows to your will, Knight Commander. My, my. Such a terrible commotion. This mage incites rebellion, Your Grace. I am dealing with the matter. Ah, Orsino. So frustrated. Do you think this is truly wise? I... No, Your Grace. Of course not. Young men, would you show the first enchanter back to the circle? Gently, if you please. Your Grace! He should be clapped in irons, made an example of. That's enough, Meredith. This demeans us all. Surely you can see that. Go back to the gallows and calm down, like a good girl. You have my thanks for stepping in, champion. If you had not... You're the Grand Cleric. Aren't you in charge of the Templars and Circle? Oh, my. You have quite the estimation of my abilities. <laughs> quite the estimation of my abilities. Gentle people of Kirkwall. Oh, man, this is Return hilarious. to your homes. I implore you. This will not be solved today. And now I must attend to the gallows. They will see reason. If the Maker wills it. Thank you again, Champion. Ooh. All quiet around here, Captain. Good. Carry on. Well, we finished Act Two, but we never saw. I guess we didn't have enough friendship with uh, Isabella for her to come back <clears throat> and help us out. That's okay. Let's see here. Let's start Act Three. Act Three. I'm hoping. We immediately start with 
This is Gamelin. Okay, so let's just let's just try not Have to. Have I ever mentioned that I like your court? You do? It's very lively, like a crow in the middle of hunting. That's that's great. Thanks, Meryl. The that's my house. Uh, well, let's just go into my house. See what happens. <clears throat> that ruckus has been going on for some time. Can you calm him down? The old lady is scary. There is no old lady. What's this about? Oh, my boy sees things sometimes. Says he saw an old lady standing by his bed. She has a scary laugh. Yes, well, there you go. <laughs> There's both. There you go. Oh. Can you give me another rune? It's very short. Oh, that's good. I'm glad Fenriel is doing well. <laughs> it's perfect. Everybody wants my money now. Gloves of the champion. Hmm, we'll have to get a see if we can get the rest of those that outfit. Meryl. I can't bring myself to change anything about Mother's room. Let's go see what's going on with her put pooch. Easy boy. What is it? All right, let's see. Please don't open the door. You've caught a burglar. Good boy. 
My legs are cramping. Please, just let me go. You expect me to just let you walk out of here? Please, Sarah. I was seduced by a crime at a very young age, but your guard monster has scared me towards a path of honest work. I'll give you to the count of five before I sick my Mavari on you. What? Surely you wouldn't. One. B but. Two. <laughs> Three, four, five. Make sure our guest leaves quickly. Sure it's up that guy, but I mean, since I'm a rogue. I'm sorry about your mama. I will miss her. The lady's voice makes me sad all the time. All right, Meryl. What do you got? High Town is such a strange place. It feels like it's miles away from everywhere else. Alienage, Sundermount, Ferelden, those could be from a dream. Ah, oh, Marvinan, I didn't see you there. I'm going to visit the Alienage. Do you want anything from Low Town? Are you close to many of the people in the Alienage? No, uh, not really. I think most of them don't even know my name. I'm stopping by my house for a bit. That's all. I've left some things undone there. I'll be back later. Whatever you're doing, watch yourself, Meryl. I will. Thank you, Marvinan. Back before dark, I promise. Come on, Daisy. You shouldn't be stuck in this rat trap. Does Hawk even know you're here? I don't have to ask permission to come to my own house, Varric. Just take a walk around the Low Town Market. Get some air, and I'll stop bothering you. I... know you mean well, but I have too much to do right now. I'll let you talk some sense into her, Hawk. Beric is very sweet, frequently infuriating and a terrible busybody, but sweet. I probably should have told Bodan where I was going. I hope I didn't worry you. What brought you back down here? I'm still trying to make it work. The mirror, I mean. I'm so close. In the market the other day, out of the corner of my eye, I thought I saw Tamlin. I blinked, and he was gone. I don't know what it meant. Maybe nothing. Maybe I'm going mad. I miss them all. Even the Keeper. I'm sure the Keeper would like to see you again. Yep, I'm sure she would. She loves to lecture. I bet her new first appreciates that. I wish I could have seen it. It doesn't matter. I'm here now. Maybe Varric was right. Shall we go out for a bit? I could use some sunshine. Let's go out for a bit, she says. She could use some sunshine. Okay. 
I suppose you're just thrilled how the Knight Commander's basically stepped into the Viscount's seat. She can't stall the process forever. It's not her place. Leaving the Viscount's seat empty will just tempt people to fight for it. It will cause more trouble than it prevents. Well, you've got a brain in there after all. I was convinced that headband was to keep it from falling out. Anders is such a jerk. You're a jerk, Anders. Oh, what's Champion? That? It's Leah. Do you remember me? You saved me from that murderer when I was a kid. Sorry, Captain. I don't mean to. Not at all. Go on. I wanted to say thank you. I wasn't thinking straight the day you saved me. That monster deserved what he got. Captain? Dismissed. She joined the guard a few months back. She's got a good understanding of what we're up against. Well, that was neat. Okay. Cool. And now we're in Act 3, so we have to go... <clears throat> now, like, each act basically resets the zones, and I get to go wander around them again. Looking for things to pick out of barrels. Alright, it seems like a smart thing to do is to go check on my uncle. I mean, he's kind of a jerk, but he's our jerk. He's family. Because it's all about family. <clears throat> Alright, let's go check on him. I hope he's doing okay. Uncle, what kind of trouble have you gotten yourself into this time? Yeah, couple new! <laughs> Leave that alone. There are things in my life. That note mentioned the gem of Karoshek. What's that? It's nothing. Never mind. If you're worried about who sent the note, I can go in your place. Did I ask for that? I don't know who sent it, and I don't want to. I lost everything chasing that gem. Our fortune, our home, even Mara. Who's Mara? She's... None of your concern. That's who she is. <laughs> Why don't you head uncle. back to your fancy house in Hightown and stay out of my damn business? Well, I mean, we can... We're not going to be able to do that. That's not my job. I am the champion of Kirkwall. Comes one of the job requirements is like uh, helping your uncle. I have to admit, Anders, of the mages I know, you're the one I expected to go out in a blaze. The day is young. It was a compliment, you ass. No, it wasn't. So do we have anything from Varric? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna need to go get some lunch. You must join us. Do you see that now? You must stand with Kirkwall's mages. It's not my fight. You can't hide in Sundermount. There is no plan for you among the Dalish. No, my clan is all I ever cared about. Everything I did, I did for them. On second thought, maybe don't try to help us. I thought one of these had a merchant in it. Ah, oh, yeah. for someone to sleep. I'm your man. Oh yeah, that feels better.
Two forms and four gloves of the champion. We're looking for the champion outfit. If you think that was bad, I should tell you about the Black Marsh. <laughs> See, when you say things like that, Blondie, it just makes me glad I didn't know you sooner. Who goes to a place named Black Marsh on purpose? Now, they called it Beer Marsh. No, still doesn't work. You've got a point. The marsh part does cancel out anything else. Flower Marsh, Kitten Marsh. No, no good. Ah, you've got company. I'll see you later. Mark, what can I do for you? What was Anders here for? Only place in Kirkwall he can get a decent drink. Blondie comes by here and I put him on my tab. He's got some stories about his days in Ferelden that sound implausible, even to me. He's not bad for a mage. Crazy, but that's most everyone in this city. I'm not here on business. Just dropping by. Drinking is business, champion. You know that. <laughs> so, what's the word in Lowtown, <clears throat> Varric? Nothing you don't know already. The Viscount's departure, a vacuum of power, troubles brewing. Get rid of one thread and another appears. I'm starting to think this city's in love with Crisis. Hope you're ready for it, my friend. I'm keeping Bianca close. Do you ever feel like the world's getting simpler? Like everything from eating to fighting is a lot less complex than it used to be. Mmm, let's just go to Lowtown. I want to go talk to the maid, the market. Your mm. husband agrees with me. About what? He thinks the Knight Commander's mad. He told me she's gone behind your back to investigate guardsmen she suspects as secret mages. Even if that were true, he wouldn't tell you. He won't fight for her when the time comes. Would you turn against your own husband? I don't know if you're lying or crazy. Secondary, <clears throat> go to Dark Town. Anders in Dark Town. Sounds like we'll go to Dark Town.
Are you the ones who sent the note about the gem of Karoshe? We were beginning to think you wouldn't show. It's rude to keep people waiting, you know? It's not like I don't got things to do. I think you have mistaken me for someone else. I don't know you. You don't got to know me. You just got to listen. See, we was hired to give you a note. But this gem of Kirashek thing the note talks about... We decided we want that instead. You better hand it over. I'm surprised you know what a note is. Let alone know how to read one. I don't need to know how to read. All I need to know is which end of the sword goes where. We aren't going anywhere without that gem. Let's change our gameplay back to normal. People choose to win. What do you mean? In your mirror? What do you see? A warrior? A wife? All the mistakes I made to get here and make it right. Why? What have you decided to see? Sometimes it's hard to tell. Cracks, mostly. Maybe I'll borrow yours sometime. If that's all right. It's all right. Meryl. You think I don't know the city guard is just another arm of the Templars? <clears throat> that is completely unfair. If they show up here, I'll know who to blame. That's all I'm saying. The way she walks cracks me up. I didn't mean for you to see that. I just can't be too careful. Now that the Knight Commander has basically appointed herself Viscount. I can't even imagine how difficult it is to be a mage here now. It's easy for most of them. They're long since tranquil. The mage underground is all but destroyed, and those left have turned to blood magic as their only option, which Meredith knows will prevent any chance of the public taking their side. There's still one good mage left in the city. I don't know how you continue to believe in me. How can people be so blind? The Blight was stopped only with the aid of two mages, one an apostate. But it makes no difference. The Chantry set us on this path long ago. It would take something truly catastrophic to change people's thinking now. Oh, Anders. Anders, Anders, Anders.
Find the missing Clonari blades and return them. Super excited about spending time like last time we spent time going around looking for those books. Do I really want to go around looking for swords. Um go to High Town and we'll go talk to Phoenix. I didn't expect you to stick around for this mess, Meryl. This has nothing to do with your elves. I love Hawk. I wouldn't go anywhere. But it's not your fight. I love Hawk. You said that. I say it a lot. It makes things clearer. It takes away doubt when everything is crazy and people are dying. I understand. Oh, good. Someone should. <laughs> I love Hawk. Jeez, so sweet. Many Canari fell in Kirkwall when we departed. I am sent to gather their swords. If you find a Canari sword, return it to me. Don't you want their bodies too? Their husks serve no purpose. The weapons shall satisfy a demand of the Kune. This is what I found. Do you require gold for this task? I'm not doing this for the money. Very well. Catastrophe has struck, partner. We are ruined. Ruined. Calm yourself. Don't panic. Tell me what happened. A guard came back from the boon pit, half wrecked, with a dozen mangled bodies. The horse pulling the cart was the only survivor, and it does not speak. Town full of rotten mages, and not one can get answers from a horse. I'll see what's going on. Until then, try to stay calm. I knew I could depend on you. Just, Just like old times, partner. Like old times, partner. Okay, that seems really good. More attack and critical chance. So let's give her the hangman girdle. I will use this. 
Um, we will give him bonus healing. We are that coin here, champion. Nine damage. Bunch of attack and resist. Get an extra point. If it isn't the champion. Yeah, we'll have to ask, um... Have you located any Canari blades? This is what I found. If you find more, bring... No, that can't be true. Meredith wouldn't stand for it. It's pointless. Ah, the champion of Kirkwall. Your reputation precedes you. Precedes you? Forgive oh. me. I should introduce myself You're properly. You're from Orle. My name is Nancio Caldera no, Lavis. Antiva. I am a noble from the beautiful country of Antiva. Is there something I can help you with? I've come to you in search of aid. An elven assassin I have been chasing is loose in the area. Unfortunately, he's hidden himself what? among the local Dalish, no doubt what is going on, on their there? shared heritage. He's a master manipulator who will endanger even his own kind to ensure his survival. You don't seem the type to hunt assassins. Why are you after him? At first, it was merely a duty to Antiva, but after losing so many good men to him, it became personal. What is happening? He's nothing but a murderer, a thief, and a liar. What? Why? Why is that guard standing right behind him? 
Your assassin is no fool. I doubt the Dalish would hand a fellow elf over to you, murderer or no. Ah, so you see my problem. Where that elf goes, death follows. He must be captured quickly. I've heard of your dealings with the Dalish. I was hoping you could go where my men could not. Find out where the assassin is hiding, and apprehend him. I'll see what I can do. One of the Dalish, a woman named Variel, is a friend of his. I suggest speaking with her first. We won't be here when you get back. We got a campsite outside the city. Look for us there. Okay. Good, carry on. Good day to you. Okay, let's see what we're doing in here. Come on, Fenris. Where are you? Are you certain it's her? An elf matching your description on the ship you named. And alone, as far as I could tell. I need to know if it's a trap. I did as you asked, Fenris. Now it's up to you. You talk to him, Hawk. I've had my fill for today. Fenhedis, fast of us! Maybe I can help, Fenris. <sighs> it's my sister. I didn't tell you, but I followed up on Hadriana's information. Everything she said was true. I had to keep it quiet, but I eventually contacted Verania and sent her coin enough to come meet me. And now she's here. She was in Carinus after all. My sister left Magister Araman's, but according to the men I paid, it's just as Hadriana said. She's not a slave. She's a tailor, in fact. Getting a letter to her was difficult, and she didn't believe me at first. But she's finally come. You're worried, Daenerys. The more it seems he does Come with me, Hawk. I need you there when I meet her. Where is she? If we go to the Hanged Man during the day, she'll be there, for the next week at least. It would mean a lot to me. That's all I ask. Well, alright. Well, I'll help you. You're my friend. Why would I not help you? I mean, I helped Isabella and pff, she ran off and left with our relic and left us to have a war in the city. Here's what we'll do. We will do uh, you, you, and you. You and you. Oh, I'm sorry. We did everything for that group. Now we're 
Maybe we start two handed stuff. Uh, tornado. Do that. That one. Let's just do this. Okay, we are set. Let's go out the door, help. We've got lost swords, and then we've got man during the day <clears throat> I've got so many quests holy crap already it really is you Verania I I remember you we played in our master's courtyard while mother worked you called me Leto that's your name what's wrong why are you so Fenris, we have to get out of here. Ah, my little Fenris. Predictable as always. I'm sorry it came to this, Leto. You led him here. Now, now, Fenris, don't blame your sister. She did what any good Imperial citizen should. I never wanted these filthy markings, Daenerys. But I won't let you kill me to get them. <laughs> How little you know, my pet. And this is your new mistress, then. The champion of Kirkwall. Quite lovely. 
Fenris doesn't belong to anyone. Do I detect a note of jealousy? <laughs> it's not surprising. The lad is rather skilled, isn't he? Shut your mouth, Denarius. <sighs> the word is master. I hate it when if uh, what's wrong? I and this is your new mistress then. Okay, since the game decided that
I had no choice, Leto. Stop calling me that. He was going to make me his apprentice. I would have been a magister. You sold out your own brother to become a magister? Your sister's a mage? You bloody hypocrite. You really are just jealous. You have no idea what we went through, what I've had to do since Mother died. This was my only chance. And now you have no chance at all. And now you have no Please, chance at all. Don't do this. Please tell him to stop. Benritz, stop. <clears throat> Wait. Don't kill her. Why not? She was ready to see me killed. What is she to me other than just one more tool of the Magisters? She's your sister. This is your family, Fenris. Sister. Get out. You said you didn't ask for this, but that's not true. You wanted it. You competed for it. When you won, you used the boon to have Mother and I freed. Why are you telling me this? Freedom was no boon. I look on you now, and I think you received the better end of the bargain. That's... how can that be true? I thought discovering my past would bring a sense of belonging. Bring a sense of belonging. But I was wrong. But I was wrong. Magic has tainted that too. There is nothing for me to reclaim. There is nothing I am alone. You're not alone. You have friends. Is that what we are? It sure isn't me. You do have friends, Fenris. You heard what Verania said. I wanted these. I fought for them. I feel unclean. Like this magic is not only etched into my skin, but has also stained my soul. And stained Let's my go. Soul. I need to get out of here. I want the loot. Why don't you let me loot? <coughs> I wanted to loot that dude's body. Fenris rivalry. That's fine. Um... Okay, now Anders wants us to speak to him in his clinic, but we still need to talk to Aveline. First, let's go turn this sword in, or go talk to my... You feel like a citizen, Fenris. Excuse me? You've been in Kirkwall as long as I have. Does it feel like home? I have no comparison, really. It feels like a free place. Maybe that's enough. We shall see. What do you want now? I found this note on a thug who attacked me. It mentions your wallet, Mallet. <laughs> Haven't played wallop since I was a kid. Still got my mallet up on the wall, though. Last time I was any good at something. So, you've done well for yourself. I had my doubts the first time I saw you, but I guess there was something to that hawk fellow Leandra ran off with after all. He certainly produced an amazing daughter. Your mother would be proud. I just wish mother had lived to see me become champion. I know Leandra, and she'd be absolutely glowing from all the praise that's been heaped on you. I don't say this often, but... We're the only family we've both got left. For a long time, I thought the Amel line in Kirkwall would end at me. I'm glad you've pulled it out of the grave. Okay, well that's good. So now what do we got? In the Kahel, the tree of the people, the elven alien. Bone pit. Companions always first. Companions first. Okay, I've got to go. I've got fifth, ten minutes. Let's go do one more thing. I understand you're named after a famous knight. Everyone always brings. Stop 
the name. I've not heard of Sir Aveline. Is she very famous? Really? They don't tell of her glorious downfall into Vinter? Not to slaves. Pardon me for saying so, but thank the Maker for that. The tree that Malak was made from is here in the alienage. So this is the tree Gamlin's Wallop Mallet comes from. Wallop Mallet? You must be the one I'm supposed to give this note to. Did someone ask you to give this to me? I was given a few coins to hand this over to whoever came asking about Wallop Mallets. Unfortunately, the person was hooded, and it was dark. I didn't get a good look. Obviously a human, though. No mistaking that. Even hooded. You all look alike. A warehouse now. We are being played with. We are being played with. I do like his uh, little quips. Docks at night. Okay. Is there a way out of here? We need to go to Abilene's office. Did I hear correctly? You are an abomination. Why don't you shout? I don't think everyone heard you. Do you see yourself as harmless, then? An abomination who would never harm anyone? Hello again. Like ripping someone's heart out of his chest? I did that at the behest of no demon. So we agree that it doesn't take a demon for someone to be a vicious killer. Good. Whoop. Oh boy, this is gonna end poorly. Okay, so. Guardsman, duties for the week will be low town canvas. Five on, three off. City perimeter by twos. Clear by second watch. Training recruits full metal by week's end. Anything else, Captain? No. Thank you. Donick is a good man. I'm sorry, was there something you wanted? You never said how your three weeks in Orlais went. You're right. I didn't. Well, good for you. Anything else? Your men could give the Templars a run for their sovereigns. They've had to. As long as there's no Viscount, the Order thinks they can bark at any man in uniform. I won't have it. The people of Kirkwall need to see themselves in their guard. Lose that connection, we're just targets. Kirkwall seems to have rallied around you. I try to keep order, and people appreciate that. Everything else is going insane. A few complaints here and there, but for the most part, I think everyone's just glad the guard has been stable for a few years. Just checking in. Need anything? Yes, there's something. Come back soon. I'll get into it then. I'll see you later. Of course, Hawk. Come back soon. 